A spring flowering small tree that blooms before the leaves appear is the Saucer Magnolia. And this year we've had weather that has cooperated to give us a wonderful display. Now sometimes, and what usually happens with these trees is that they'll begin to bloom maybe late February, early March, and the flowers get frozen by a, a freeze or a frost, and we end up with sort of brown globs until the leaves appear. But uh, this year we've had some nice weather and the trees are really spectacular. They also give us a nice fragrance. Now the saucer magnolia is actually a hybrid plant. It's a cross between two Chinese magnolia species. One of the trees or one of its parents has white flowers and the other parent has pink flowers. So that's why we get sort of that bicolored effect here with the, the pink more on the outside and the white on the inside. The bark of the trees is somewhat showy, kind of gives us that nice silvery effect, effect. And we usually see these as multi-trunk specimens. They're very attractive in the landscape just with that trunk or that branching pattern. Now sometimes you'll read that you can plant your saucer magnolia on the north side of your home to sort of slow down the arrival of spring weather. And true, that will delay spring or that, those warm temperatures from causing the plant to start flowering about a week or, or two weeks. But if you only have a single story home, the tree will eventually get tall enough that you sort of lose that protection. But uh, still a, a wonderful plant to have in the landscape for when we do have that cooperating weather and give us this wonderful fragrant display. Similar to the saucer magnolia is the star magnolia. It has flowers that appear on the tree before the leaves come on. It's a little bit smaller than the saucer magnolia. In fact, it's going to max out at about 12 to 14 feet tall, by about 12 to 14 feet wide. I personally like the star magnolia more so than the saucer magnolia because it doesn't seem to be bothered as much by a few light frosts. It doesn't seem like the flowers end up freezing as bad as the saucer magnolias do. You can see the petals are, are thinner, they're more strap-like, and the plant is uh, just a little more daintier than the saucer magnolia. The fragrance is much sweeter. I mean, it's just a, a delight to be close to this plant. But this is one that would fit well on the north side of your home and be protected a little bit better from a late spring freeze. The saucer magnolia, again, is from China, but the star magnolia here is from Japan. Wonderful small tree or large shrub-like plant.